What is up, everyone, and welcome back to Bald Man Reacts. A couple of months ago, I did a video for Be Under Arms. It was requested by the singer Anna Lotsagova. She's an awesome person. You should certainly check out the band and her Facebook page. And she said I should check out another one of their tracks called Don't Fear Death. It's a different one for them. It was done a couple of years ago. And I have been waiting to get back to these guys and gal. I think they're a really, really incredible band. And I'm looking forward to hearing this track. So come along for the ride with me. We're checking out the band Be Under Arms. The track is Don't Fear Death. And here we go. I like the acoustic opening here with that almost military march like snare drum cadence. It's a really impressive way to open this track. Really enjoy that mid range and her cleans that she uses here. Like the guitar accents. It's an interesting effect on her voice, too. Never heard him sing clean. That's a really cool touch. Really deep and rich clean tone to his voice. Nice vocal layering there. Track is building incredibly well here. Outstanding cool vocals. Almost reminds me a little bit of early Lacuna Coil with the way her vocals sound here. Love that tone to his clean vocals. Kicked in really well. It was a seamless transition. They've layered her aggressives and cleans very well. I'm not sure I like the effect on his aggressive vocals, but I like the placement of them. It's really got a haunting vibe to it. That slightly percussive attack on the acoustics there is a really cool accent. Really subtle cymbal accents. A lot of little nuances going on here. Right, that was Be Under Arms. The track is Don't Fear Death. And that was awesome. It built very, very well. It's strong from start to finish. I didn't know if it was gonna if you were gonna have a slightly heavier influence come in at some point. I think the trade-offs between Anna and her husband are awesome. The chemistry between those two is there, and 
it really shows in the track. I really enjoy hearing him sing clean. And that really deep, rich bass vo like tone in his voice. I do feel like in the aggressive part of the track, he's so low that he's almost competing in the frequency range with the guitars and the bass. They're almost stepping on each other just because they're both down really low. So in the mix, I might have cleaned that up a little bit. But it's a really strong track. It's a really enjoyable track. It's shorter than it than I expected, but that was really, really strong, and I'm happy to finally get these guys and gal back on the channel. They're doing a lot of touring this year. I know they just had a big concert announcement. I don't remember. Oh, actually, the big concert announcement is they're playing with the Butcher Babies in Moscow here in a couple of months. It's in September, I believe. So congratulations to them for landing that spot with them in Moscow. I know they are touring quite a bit lately. They're gigging and they're doing their best to promote their music. So please, if you enjoy them, go check them out. Check out their Facebook page. The links will be in the description below. Give these guys some love. They certainly deserve it. They're really cool people. So once again, thank you to the band for giving me a chance to check out your stuff. I truly love everything I've heard so far, and I cannot wait to do more for you. You're good people. Thank you to all of you for being here. I love you guys. I appreciate you. Thank you to my law enforcement, military, veterans, and first responders for what you do every day. As always, you have been awesome. I have been bald, man. I will see you in the next one. Be excellent to each other, and keep headbanging.